So we've seen Vegeta on a full 200% lead, but I haven't seen anybody take him on a 170% team. So mine's almost rainbowed. Um, we're gonna put him to the test. We're on Broly's team. Not only that, but we're on the hardest fight in the game. Cell Max. I am asking for all the smoke, bro. Here we go. Let's just do it, man. So Vegeta is good. Okay, let's get that out the way. Vegeta is very good. Now, I didn't leave myself any ores for this turn. <laughs> but Vegeta is super good. Let's, let's not get anything twisted. However, on a 170% lead, I ain't gonna lie. In a fight like this, he gets cooked. Matter of fact, most cards besides Beast Gohan gets cooked in this fight on a 170% lead. So we're going to see the good, the bad, and the ugly with this Vegeta, bro. <laughs> now, that being said, um, I like that rotation. Or I guess I like both of these rotations on this team. Uh, Broly and Beast go on uh, on one rotation. Then on the second rotation, we got the Tech Vegeta with the Int Vegeta, right? Now, the Tech Vegeta... I'm sorry to pop your bubble, but he's going to be taking some damage on this fight. Like, at least for the first few turns. Now, the cool thing, though, is that the Int LR Vegeta, once he gets hit five times, he's going to have his revive, right? And you can definitely alternate them both in slot one or two, depending on the fight. And in most content, it's going to work out pretty good, right? But in this fight, it's where it gets tough. So if we lose in this, don't be surprised. Like, I I'm not going to be surprised. But I at least want to at least showcase some numbers, how he's going to tank. Uh, you know what I mean? Definitely, at first, he's going to be taking damage, like, for sure. Like, he's going to be taking, like, over 100k, like, for normals. I did a test run, and, boy, it was not pretty. I'm not even going to sugarcoat nothing. Um, now, this team is okay, but... A lot of people aren't on the 200%. I mean, this is a good team, but you just got to be fine with not everyone being, like, to their full potential, right? Um, Beast Gohan's on the 200%, though, which is very good. Um, besides that, I want to say everybody else, obviously not counting Broly, is on the 170%. Now, if you, if you already seen... We actually brought that man, Kai Goku, on this team. So, wait, look how much this Broly's going to take. 241. Honestly, that was that was pretty good. That's because Beast Gohan gives a damage reduction. But I did a run, and he took almost 500k. So, put that into perspective when you're looking at this Vegeta, okay? Now, we got the Vegeta on rotation. He's at 147k defense. He's going to get more defense, but definitely not anything hot to start out with. We're going to put the other Vegeta in front to get some hits. And not only that, but uh, because he's going to be a better tank for this turn. And let's see how this flows and let's see how this goes. But yeah, Kai Goku's on here because uh, he can help heal. And he also um, is that Goku that is required for tech vegeta to get uh more stacks right unfortunately the str vegeto isn't on this team he's not on transformation boost because before they transformed it's helpful having that goku around right um and then when he does transform he heals but we're missing out on that but that's okay let's see how we take these normals hopefully we can get a good amount of supers right here um please because if we don't get like four supers, we're gonna be eating like over a hundred k. Let's see if we can get one more. Uh, let's see if we can get the hidden potential system additional to kick in because we're gonna need it, bro. Okay, see, so I mean it wasn't over a hundred k, but you guys saw right there, eighty eight k, fifty k. Um, if he ate a super right there, bro, if I had to guess, it would be more than like. 550k like it'd probably be 600k and a like no cap because uh, this cell max bro <laughs> this cell max does not play man i'm telling you 
Uh, I don't know if it's like the car that's an issue or if it's just, you know, Cell Max. He's just, he's just that good. Being real. Now I'm already, <laughs> I'm already tempted to use that target attack, man. Man, this is, this is going rough, bro. Should I? Because te uh, Carnival Goku needs to be hit. Uh, I'm, I'm not gonna risk it. Unfortunately, we're gonna just have to use this already. Let's go. It definitely wasn't outside of the realm of possibility for us to survive this turn, but I'm not even going to take that chance, bro, to be honest. Oh, yeah, let's get that heal with these orbs. Yes, sir. That's going to help tremendously. And, yeah, it does suck. Like, we wanted Kai Goku to get those hits because he gets defense after the fifth hit, but... Honestly, I didn't even know if we would live to see that day. Like, being for real. <laughs> We're going no items, so I'm not going to take the chance. And it's not, like, the worst ever that we had to use that already. Because, honestly, with this Cell Max, his hardest turns are the first four turns, bro. Because uh, you can't seal him. You can't lower his attack. Right? So... That's why it's not too bad. Once we get past turn four, it's going to look a little easier, uh, especially because Vegeta seals, right? So this can work out, like for sure. If, Especially if we get the revive with the Int Vegeta and we just keep him in slot one for most of the fight, then the Type Vegeta, he won't have to eat a super because if the Int Vegeta doesn't, eat the super he can just seal him at that point in slot two right so it's kind of strange like you're used to running this guy in slot one and in most content you can but i would mainly advise uh to leave him in in the first in the second slot for most of this fight now we're at the point where we can seal this man uh but uh, I was gonna leave him in slot too. But honestly, I want I want the uh, the Int Vegeta to get his hits so we get the revive, right? Uh, I'm tempted. Yeah, let's just do that. Sure, sure. So yeah, now as you can see, now this guy's gonna be eating because now we can seal this guy. Yes, sir. Oh yeah. <laughs> so things are gonna be looking good. Um. See if we can get his stacks in. See if we can get to a point where he's doing double digits. And yeah, guys, even even against the hardest fight, he's still putting in that work, bro. <laughs> so we can definitely get the revive later. Um, since this guy's going to get all the hits he needs. We just got to survive next turn, which, again, shouldn't be hard. Because his seal lasts for two turns, I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong, but I want to say, and guys, I know you're thinking like, oh, he's sealing, like, you can't do that too often, but honestly, in the new content, you actually can seal a lot of these fights, uh, especially in the early phases, but look, this is the hardest fight, and you can seal, so that's definitely something that you need to consider when talking about this Vegeta, and talking about him on a 170%, right? So far, so good, right? We're going to be getting more stacks every time uh, Kai Goku comes around. Man, it's crazy hearing this Broly just, like, box this man up. Like, <laughs> it's actually wild. Uh, but, yeah, this team this team ain't bad, bro. This team is not bad. Hey, bro, chill. <laughs> this team ain't bad. I feel like... We can beat this guy. Like, honestly, I wasn't sure if we would lose or, or win. But, because, okay, I did a test run. And no cap, bro, it went bad. Like, I mean, the rotation was bad. Uh, we got body. Like, yeah. As you can see, this stun in the top left, it does last for two turns. Now, we do got to be a little careful with this uh, Gogeta here. He can take damage. 
if he doesn't dodge. Let's go ahead and transform with these guys though. Who do you think had the better transformation animation right there? Uh, type 1 in the comments for Broly, type 2 in the comments for Gogeta. <laughs> Honestly, I don't want to influence y'all's opinions, but I feel like I feel like Broly had the better transformation, bro. I know people going to get mad, but it is what it is, bro. Now, I was saying before, Gogeta can take some damage, right? Because at this point, Broly's domain... Not only is it weakening uh, super class allies, but it actually buffs the the cell too, <laughs> which is crazy, right? Like it makes the cell max our enemy. It makes him hit harder. So I think that's stupid. Like, why do the domains count like bosses as well? I think that's kind of dumb, bro. Like maybe if you want to debuff, but what about like buffing, like? I find that crazy, bro. So let's see how he does. At the same time, though, we have Beast Gone giving the rotation some damage reduction. Um, and I just looked over and seen my computer is gonna die. So this just suddenly turned into a speed run. <laughs> oh man, bro! I, I swear I charged it up like so much before this, bro. That's crazy. But yeah, as you guys can see, Broly on the full 200%, like. He goes to town, man. He just starts wrecking Shaw. You feel me? Oh, and then my, my Broly has the dodge as well. Now, I'm a little worried about this Gogeta. Hopefully, I mean, he's full dodge too. Hopefully, this man can get some dodges in. Um, I mean, we can definitely eat probably like one attack. Maybe two normals, but I don't think he can eat more than that. So, let's see. Next time we got Gogeta, he should have his uh, his target ability, which is going to be clutch since we already used Beast Gohan's target. Um, let's see, man. I'm a little nervous, bro. I'm a little nervous. I can't lie. <laughs> and next turn, hopefully we can get the revive off with Vegeta as well. And then you guys are going to see, like, some crazy damage on this team, bro. Like, <laughs> even though these guys are on the 170%, like, it's hard to tell like oh look at that oh bro look at his hp <laughs> what the heck bro <laughs> wow so there's no doubt in my mind that we're probably going to die here. Uh, let's see. 525k is pretty good though. But yeah, uh, we 100% are dead right here. Like there is no... Which kind of sucks because we we're just about to get his stack. His extra stack with Goku. Um, it is what it is though. Um, we did want to die this turn. And he supers. Let's see how much this does. This is probably like almost a mil bro. Before he attacks. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this dude doesn't play. Bulma, Trunks, Bulma, Kyabeto no yakusoku, Saiyajin toshite no hokori, Ore no sumete, Sutete tamaru ka! Man, I don't get tired of that animation, bro. That is clean. And check it out. We got the Brolies here. Y'all already know what happens when we start getting up in this territory, right? So that revive was pretty cool because it allowed us to... I mean, you guys saw how little Gogeta had us starting that next turn. If we didn't have the revive right there, 
that was a hundred percent chance of death like guaranteed bro like because no matter what he was gonna super in that first slot we were dead bro uh, like you guys see how like crazy vegeta is the intelligence vegeta you guys see how crazy this team is low-key like we're utilizing so much stuff we got the target with bees going we got the domain with uh broly right we got the other broly that's sharing all his links with the domain look at this damage 25 mil look at the damage okay then on the next turn we got the vegeta the tech one who's pretty good once he gets his stacks up um and he can transform get an attack break he can guard we got the intelligence vegeta who got the revive off right there once he gets his revive when you guys see him on the next turn he's gonna be busted right then also the tech vegeta ceiling as well when he can right we didn't get the seal last time but next turn we'll get the seal um bro look at the damage <laughs> okay then we got kai goku who might not seem that good but he's helping vegeta stack he's uh if you if you survive the turn with less than 40 percent hp he is gonna heal us up right he also in some fights he can nullify key blast attacks and again he's giving that vegeta the stack he's crazy uh what else then we got Gogeta, right? Gogeta might have taken a lot of damage right there. But we can get the target with him next time he comes around, the target ability. And then we can get the 100% guaranteed dodge. Right? So there's a lot of utilization on this team, buddy. Don't get it twisted. Look at how much damage we just did on this turn. And, bro, honestly, I feel like the tech Vegeta... And maybe even the Intelligence Vegeta should have been on Exploding Raid. How much does this do? 500k. So you guys see how hard uh, Cell Max just hit uh, that Gogeta, right? You guys saw that. So now we got him at 583k. Okay, we got some stuff to mess around with. Here we go. <laughs> That was pretty crazy, man. Now we got a full guarantee dodge. We got Vegeta uh, transformed. <laughs> Yeah, I wanna, I wanna do this. Uh, I wanna do this just to show you guys. Like, once you get the revive, this guy can still do crazy damage despite uh, despite what's it called? What's it called, man? <laughs> that that rotation just threw me off right there. But despite him being on a full, on a one seventy percent. We can still get insane damage right here. Check this out. <laughs> he still hit 20 mil on a 170%, bro. This team is stupid, man. Now you guys believe me, right? Now you guys see 
how insanely busted this is. Like, you you might need some RNG at times, especially with your rotations. But overall, man, we made it happen. No items used, no support memories. If you enjoyed this video, then you should check out that video where we showed them on the 200%. That video is going to be on screen right now. And I'm going to catch y'all in the next one. Peace.